Hello Pisces, welcome to Happy Soul Journey. So today we'll look into your the story for the Fab 2021. Uh, this is for Sun, Moon and Rising. You can watch it for your Mercury, Mars, Venus. My Mars, Venus and Mercury is in Pisces. So, you know, for few readers, I like, you know, I resonate with their Pisces. So let's see what is here for you. And if you resonate with the Pisces in that way, then definitely look for the Pisces reading from Happy Soul Journey, okay? So, the links for the other zodiacs are in the description box below. So, if you are interested in the other signs, then you can definitely go and watch that. So, Page of Cups. You know, the Cups energy, ooh! The cups energy was very, very, you know, I was feeling very, very emotional for Pisces. I was feeling like there's a lot of emotion that Pisces are in, but uh, their, uh, you know, their attention is somewhere else. Their attention is not in the place that they are in. Their attention is somewhere else. Their focus is somewhere else. No matter how much they are drowned inside the water. Ooh, attention is somewhere else. That's what I want. Depth. And so attention is somewhere else. And uh, for, you know, you are not even feeling that, oh, a lot of cups, Scorpio energy, a lot of cups, a lot of cups here. I was already feeling it. So, your attention is somewhere else. How many times you will say the attention stuff, Chetna? I think Pisces needs to hear that, that your attention is somewhere else. You need to focus. Focus where you are. Focus how you can move out of it if it's not good for you. You know, Pisces, you are so, so stuck in your mind and you don't even know that. The bad part is that you don't even know that. And you didn't even knew that. I will actually say that you didn't know that in the past. And slowly, because there was a desire for change and you were not seeing it clearly that, you know, how you can do that and what's the wrong thing which was happening. I think now you are seeing things in a much, much, much better way. Clarity, more, more clarity, more, more things that you are unable to see because of the shedding of that emotional part and getting the emotional maturity. And now not just looking at your cups, now you're looking at the actual things, not just looking at your emotions, you're looking at much more stuff that you can have or you need to address. Clarity will grow, 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 grow. And the plants of abundance will grow, 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 grow. You'll get an actual kind of directionality here, Pisces, which uh, you lost in a way. You were not aware of it. Uh, you were in the energy like, you know, now I know, I know, I know, but still you don't know. You will know. You Still you don't know. You are still like in a process of knowing. But you will know it, the direction that you need to go and what you need to do, what is, what is meant for you, who is meant for you, who is good for you, who is not good for you. You are in the energy of differentiation and maybe the uh, truth will hurt you a bit. You know, because truth involves maybe leaving something, leaving someone, leaving a dream behind, leaving a goal behind. But uh, the thing that you will gain is that what you are meant to do, what is good for you, what will bring you happiness, courage, strength, foundation. Strength is also a sexual card for me, a good sexual life. 
and it is also a Leo card. And Leo Moon, we know it affected me in a good way. It opened my heart to whatever I actually wanted to do with few stuffs with my uh, in my life, and I was just keep on delegating it, keep on delegating it, keep on delegating it for some reason. But I got the clarity now. You know, it's time. It's time, dude. We need to do this. And the same way, Pisces, you will get the energy, you will get the feeling, you will get the sting. It's time, dude, that you need to do it. And this will be good. Okay? Things will take some time to fruition because there was a lot of energy, of, you know, when it was not clear. So things were not that clear in the past, in the present. But it is slowly getting clear. So things will be slow. But maybe this is just the time for the sowing the seeds. And seeds are going underground. Taking the leap of faith. Okay. And don't think like things will not come into fruition. Whatever your heart is talking about. Whatever uh, it is telling you. Like you know dude this is the right path. Actually, that's the right path and you need to take towards that leap of faith, uh, take your step towards that thing no matter. <sighs> right now, you are not seeing that what that seed can do. Maybe for some time you will not see. But it will grow. And it will be a fruit. And you will see it. So start the process because now you have got the clarity. Make the change. If you are somewhat, you know, someone wants to be a teacher or a guru or some kind of thing and you are like, you're just, you're just making yourself feel like you're not good enough for that. I think you're good enough. Fruits. Fruits. Soulmate. A thing from the past. A goal, a dream from the past, which will you just said, you know. I don't think so. I'm enough for this thing. I don't think so. I deserve it. Or you were just settling for something which was not good for you just because you are feeling like you're not good enough for much more than that. It will be like, you know, the child think like I deserve everything. I can go into space and it will not bear me any penny. I don't have to give any penny. Child think like that. Everything is free. Everything is abundant. I can get anything, any number of toffees, any, and everything is good for me. You will get in the energy that, you know, you can get everything. And the laws will work like that. The law of attraction will work like that for you. When you know, when you think, when you feel, when you feel, when you feel like you deserve much better and more. You'll get them all. Okay? Taurus get this caption like much and better. And you will also get the caption like similar kind of line I guess. Let's see what I put in your caption. But uh, I will definitely push you in the direction of your heart. Like whatever your heart is saying, go for that. Because as a Pisces, Mercury... Venus and Mars, I'm going for that. And in Vedic, I am a Pisces. So I'm going for that. Whatever I felt, it's good for me from a very long time. And I was like, you know, no, I shouldn't do this. I shouldn't do this. I shouldn't do this. But now I'm doing it. And I'll do it. And I know I'll get succeed. One day, one fine day, Pisces will be successful. Yes, yes. Okay, so that was your reading, Pisces. And let me know how it resonated with you. And uh, like, share, subscribe. If you want a personal reading with me, you can definitely book it. Uh, my email ID is in the description box below. Website will be up really, really soon. I'm a bit easy, busy right now. So as soon as I'll be free, I will do some change. Last minute changes in the website. And 
I will publish it. Okay, so keep looking out for that. And if you're new to my channel, welcome to the Soul Family. Bye. Mwah.